boys, welcome back to the Minecore server. Um, finally back after a long break, as usual it seems. But yeah, today we are going to work on the castle. After I kill these mobs. We're going to work on the castle, so that should be good. I have already outlined, uh, not the castle, the keep, the keep of the castle, my bad. So I've outlined it here already, so it's going to be nice and big. Nice and big castle. But yeah. Let's get going here. I'm just going to... Ah, I might as well leave that. It's kind of hard working here at night. But yeah. We've got a, whole, we've got a good crowd on right now. Uh, Carl would be on with me as well, but something was screwing up with the mic, so... No Carl today. Just me. Um, but yeah. So, first thing we're going to want to do... Let's see if I can clear out my inventory. Um, we're just going to want to raise these walls up a bit. I might do a little speed up while I'm building. We'll see. I don't know right now. But yeah. <clears throat> so, this is going to be the entrance here. There's going to be a tower here. And then there's going to be classic four tower keep. Classic four tower keep. Yeah, we'll just go from there. Come on. Oof. Oh man, these skeletons are so hard now. There we go. Okay. So I think I'll work on this main entrance here first. Um, I want it to go up two more. See it. Here that should be good. Just carry this up. Mm, let's get this crafting bench down. Crafting bench down here. Uh, there we go. Perfecto. All right, let's let's start. This is going to be a tower here. I'm going after off a picture of a real castle, so. Yeah, um, it might be a bit choppy if I'm looking at the picture for reference, but I think I've got a good idea already. So, this tower's not going to be too tall, it's just going to kind of be like a little gate entrance, kind of final defense thing. And then we count out five, yeah, right here. Put in another public one up. Like this. Yeah, hope you all are enjoying the UHC. Uh, that's coming to an end soon. Um, also, I hope you enjoyed my Hunger Games little episode I put out. Let me know if you want to see more of that. I had fun doing it. But, yep. Uh, let's not quite a window here yet. Alright, gonna just want to raise this up a little bit more and then we can put in the first floor. Hmm. Oh, I'll do that later. Okay, I, I also like to just randomize stone bricks, although that's not random. Randomize them a little bit. It adds a little bit of texture to it, and I think it looks good. So we can put in a window here. Actually, you can put it one lower. One lower. Right about here. Like that. Slowly, everyone starts leaving the server. Yeah, we had a we had a big crowd. The server was full for once today, pretty much. That's a rare sight. It's mostly empty. Uh, I think this is actually a little big. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I'm gonna put that there. So that's one window. And then for this area, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. I might just round it off. For now, I just connect it with a wall, but we'll see when we get there. So now for the entrance, I'm just going to hop down here. I think this bit can actually just be a cobblestone floor as well. Before it goes into the main keep area. It's kind of like a foyer. Good, 
Very good. Okay, bring this all out for a floor. There we go. Okay. Now, this entrance, I kind of like to have it in one, but I don't know if I'll be able to do that here. Mm, yeah, no. So, I'm just going to do your average little entrance. Nothing big. The door there. This one up as well. I don't know if I'm gonna have it so you can see this. Ah, I might. Ah, yeah, I think it will actually. So, I'm gonna wanna. Actually, I'll have it so it's dirt up to here. Maybe some flowers. And then, let's bring this up. There we go. You're not really gonna be able to see that, so it should be okay. And then we have the main tower here. <clears throat> Go like this. Bring up these corners. These are going to be really tall. So this one's not going to be very tall, but the other ones will be. Here's my potatoes. Oops. Eat some food quick. Before I die. There we go. All right. This, this should be good. Bring that up. And I think I'll have this go two more up. And then that'll probably be good. And then I'll do the classic tower top there. I mean, I updated to 1.5.2 because the server did, but yeah, so no more Optifine, which is a little bit sad. But I probably will get it again for 1.6. I won't bother for this little update. And then and now we're gonna want uh, more more stone brick stairs. So I do uh, yeah. Okay. This. So it goes. This. Oops. Not like that. Not like that either. Oops. Goes like this. Right here. Okay. The corner ones will be stone brick. And then I'll have the rest. Cobblestone. Let's carry that along here. And do the same over here. go and then yeah need some more stone brick and this just all goes like this it's pretty simple but it has a nice it has a nice look to it I like it bring these all up just gonna make an area so I can walk up here this you're not really gonna see. I'm gonna need to make this so it connects with the main keep as well. So it's something to keep in mind. I think this needs to be stone brick. Okay, I'll bring this across here. And actually, I'm gonna need it here as well, so do the same thing here. Okay, let's finish this up here and over here. There we go. Now, do I have oh, not enough? Okay, make some slabs, a few more cobblestone as well. There we go. <clears throat> 
and where the stairs were, you just put the slops on top. Nice and simple. Didn't know that you can just double click. See how I had the, them all spread out. If you just double click one of them, it gathers, gathers them all together. So that's quite a nice little touch that they added. Pretty useful. And then I'm just gonna cover this top here with cobblestone again. I might change the roof of this, how I've done the other ones later, but for now we'll just do this. See how it looks. Not bad, not bad. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, that'll be good. Alright, so you're getting the idea how this is going to look. I think it's turning out good. But I think I'll probably do some more later off camera. So for now, I'll just leave it. And um, a few episodes, actually quite a, quite a while ago, I built that shop and I never showed you how it finished. So I will just head over to the nether to show you how it ended because... Yeah, I forgot to show it in one of my later episodes. 
while I was building at the castle, I think somebody came along here and filled our place full of paintings. I'll take these down someday. Although, it actually doesn't look too bad. It kind of looks kind of cool. But yeah, we will be taking these down. You look at this. Even down the mine, these guys. Pretty sure it was Jabba. Speaking of which, last episode, we did that thing on his base where we filled it up with all that junk. That whole episode was to get him to go there because we had a trap all rigged up. But what happened was, he didn't go there for like over a week, and a zombie set the trap off, and it was a very elaborate trap. Uh, I'll try to explain. Basically, what happens was, he would step on the pressure plates that opened that door, they would open it, and then the ones that would uh, open it from the other side, would the, fl the pressure plates what were on the floor would open up, he'd go down to a lower level, get shot with poison, then those that floor would open up, he'd drop through lava, which would drop down onto hoppers 24 blocks below the lava to make sure he's dead. The hoppers would go into a minecart chest, which went to our base and it would hit it, activate uh, a detector rail, which closed the, behind it and just led to uh, a chest, a uh, minecart chest, uh, with ha which had nothing but a buck in it. And yeah, but we went through all that work and then a zombie hit it. So we were pretty mad. But we'll get them back one day. You'll see. So I'm just going to make my way over to Nether just to show you. Show you the Nether shop. Another shop. See how it went down. 1.6 is in the works, which you probably already know. So pretty cool features being added. Horses. The main thing being. I think they're really cool. I'm just going to grab some of the pearls here. Oh, this is too slow. Oh, I can't hold them. There we go. Yeah, horses have been added. And what I really like about what they've done is they made them, first of all, really hard to find. And then you can't craft the armor. And the saddles either, of course. So everything's really rare. I like about it. Like all the dungeons. I like how they've improved the dungeons and stuff. And yeah, the armor can only be found in dungeons, which is really cool. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the upcoming update. I think it's going to be pretty cool. So <clears throat> what I also think would be really cool is if they, in villages, would add a stable building, which would occasionally have horses. I think that would be a cool feature to the villages. And I think they should just have chests randomly in buildings. But here we are at the shop. Welcome to the boot locker. So we've got all our different shoes. We've got Pumas here. We've got Vans, DCs, just shoes, all for different prices. And over here we have Nike Air Jordans. We've got Adidas, Reebok Zigtech, and Ski Boots. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get good enchantments on here, but all the other shoes, I think, have certain enchantments. So these ones are Blast Protection 4, Feather Flame 4, with different colors. And this is just Blast Protection 4, only two emeralds, not bad. These ones are Protection 4. These ones are Projectile Protection Feather Flame 4. Those are nice ones for five emeralds. And the Vans are projectile protection 4, the DC shoes are fire protection 4 and feather falling 4, so that's real nice. And then the dress shoes are, they're actually kind of random. I wasn't able to be picky with the more expensive boots, the leather boots I was able to have them all the same, but these ones I kind of just had to go with what they had to take because it was just too expensive to waste all those resources. And then they just placed a payment in here, it's supposed to be emeralds, but just show you, it just funnels it over here. It's pretty cool. Oh, somebody has bought a pair of boots uh, for sale. That's awesome. I <laughs> Since the shop is open, somebody's finally bought a boot. So I wonder what they bought. I think they must have bought Pumas, because I'm pretty sure I had three pairs. Well, that's cool. Anywho. Um, 
I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the episode. We've been going for... Uh, I'm not sure how long. Um, yeah, I think I might just end the episode here. Hope you guys all enjoyed it. It's probably been a shorter one today, but... Nonetheless, it's an episode, so... I will see you guys next time.